Greg Schilling, uh, Justin's dad. And, sir, what did you want to say? What did you want people to know? Well, I just wanted to talk a little bit about the, uh, the events of what's going on and, you know, the fact that, um, that there's been many thoughts uh, that have moved through my mind during the course of all of this. Um, just the sheer magnitude of these proceedings accompanied with the many variables and continuously evolving nature of the case that has kept me up at night. Uh, questions like what does this mean to me and how does it affect things moving forward lay in the forefront of my mind. Because of the fact that I am a victim in all of this, I have derived a strong opinion as it pertains to this trial. I'm sure that the fact that this is a first of its kind case and will be most likely affect the future of law, that many others have probably formed their own opinions as well. As the father of a murdered child, I feel that it is my parental responsibility to make sure that every stone is turned over and that every pertinent aspect is addressed to the fullest extent of the law especially if it has never been addressed on that level before. The fact that school shootings are relatively new in modern society, we have to accept the difficult task of identifying and addressing the root causes of these horrible events, as well as openly discuss and understand the implications of our actions as they pertain to the root causes. This is a monumental task because there are just so many factors to take into consideration. And although it will most likely take years to see the effects of these actions, it's very important for each and every one of us to acknowledge the gravity of this very real situation and understand that the level of our own responsibilities is not limited to just our direct actions, that the choices we make to not take action can ultimately affect the course of anyone's life and carries with it potential repercussions. I am just one person whose life has been affected by the actions of an individual and sadly the inactions of other individuals. I believe in the very least that the fact that this trial has even gone on and has attracted the attention of so many that it has effectively shined some light on many levels. This trial should capture the thoughts of every parent in America and at the very minimum affect the overall choices we make or don't make with regards to our children. It is not my job to determine if the results of the inactions of certain individuals is ultimately the reason for what happened. I have already drawn my own conclusion and regardless of the outcome of this trial, it is my intention to maintain the search for the truth and for full accountability. Thank you. Thank you very much. Can I ask you just one question on just sure. this weight? I can't even imagine what that's like for, for you as a victim. Um, what's mm -hmm. the weight like as a jury? Is that, are you hoping that they just take their time? Um, or just Absolutely. I mean, the, the precedent setting nature of this case is it shouldn't be, be um, surmised in one hour of deliberation. It should be every aspect of it has to be looked at and um, discussed in, in depth. And um, I hope that it, you know, that they're taking their time and they're making sure to look at all the evidence and make sure that they make the right decision. Sir, thank you so much. I appreciate your time. Thank you. Thank you.